Right, yo 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 guys, another video for today. I'm tempted to do shorts instead of these videos, but I just prefer doing videos like these as opposed to a phone camera, so, but it is what it is. Anyway, um, what's going on? What's going on? Um, I may be reacting to this a little bit late, um, but this has been doing the rounds. I just want to give my two cents on it. Um, according to Simon Stone, um, Pam McGuire has an Instagram post about Chris Ronaldo being unhappy about 21% pay cut in Er in, in error and it has in, in, now been removed and I think that was regarding like not qualifying for the Champions League um, which is fair um, okay and everyone's just make, doing a riff and roll about it so I'm going to say just, just a few things about this um, to keep it brief remember to like the video and subscribe by the way um, number one um, social media is toxic this would not have been a non-story 10 years ago. The fact that this is now a story, this is now buzz, um, really shows how, where we are, to be honest, in science. That's the first thing. Second thing um, is that I don't know what is going on at United, whether this is supposedly this kind of like, um, United leaking stuff out, there's conflict. I, I don't really know. I don't know why these stories are coming out now and we should be focusing on backing Ten Hag, the manager rebuild, and we've now got, we're now having stories that, come, that are now presumed designed to sell papers regarding Ronaldo versus everybody. Um, number three, this doesn't change what's going on with Ronaldo. Fingers crossed, it is just personal family issues as opposed to unprofessionalism. If it is unprofessionalism, this doesn't change it. And you can make an argument that being unhappy about a 20% on pay cut is not when you didn't achieve the objectives you should have achieved is is unprofessional um and the last thing is that again as i've said many times previously i generally don't believe that um that footballers are actually um that they're actually in charge of their social media accounts so people attacking Emma mcguire i'm not i mean i don't know but what i do know is that footballers generally have people that um that uh, manage their social media accounts. I don't know who they are, they might be employed, whatever, whatever. So I've often found it unlikely that like Ronaldo or Maguire, whatever, goes onto Instagram, types an Instagram and sends it, sends a thing out. I just, I generally don't believe that when, the, I think a lot of fans still think that. So when they see a, a particular player tweet or share an Instagram, they assume that it's that player doing that. I don't think that's the case. So. It looks bad on Harry Maguire's point, but I don't think it was probably it was Harry Maguire that did it um, personally. It probably was a member of his team. Who knows? But regardless, we got to stop this. We really, really got to stop this. Like, subscribe. Cheers.